Okay, so it really looks like that currently Bitcoin is seeing some kind of a reaction after taking the liquidity below our previous low. But in this video, we are going to be talking about the best price targets that can be identified on the monthly and weekly high term time frame. Because I'm going to share with you some insane Fibonacci channels that most probably you have not seen in ever before. But first of all, what you're going to see on the 4 hour time frame a couple of days ago. Bitcoin definitely got a push towards downside. We took the liquidity below our previous right here. And on top of that, going with our Fibonacci retracement from swing low to swing high, it looks like reaction is happening almost perfectly at our golden Fibonacci ratio. But the reality is because right now we got this specific push towards downside. The market structure on the Bitcoin chart is right now already looking bearish. Huh. And even for example, if there's going to be a bigger bounce towards the upside in the upcoming hours right here, I would personally expect lower targets to actually be hit on Bitcoin simply because market structure right now is bearish and we are simply moving in an average downtrend. And because of that, I need to right now share with you some of the best price targets we should pay attention to if Bitcoin actually does go lower. And first important level that I would like to show you is going to be our 0.76 Fibonacci channel level right here. Now, when we are paying attention to this specific Fibonacci channel right here, we are making it literally from the start of Bitcoin back towards the high right here at approximately $1,000, where you can see all of those levels that you can write and see on the chart have been respected very, very nicely especially our golden Fibonacci ratio where we bottomed in 2015 and also in 2020, almost a perfect bounce exactly at this specific area. Also in 2020, to a couple of months ago, a couple of months ago, we got some kind of a reaction exactly at our golden Fibonacci rate up. But at the moment, it looks like we are already breaking through this specific level towards downside and zooming out a little bit. You can definitely see 0.76 Fibonacci channel level right here has not been hit ever before on Bitcoin. And because of that, I would definitely say if we do continue rank not towards downsides, towards our 0.76 Fibonacci channel level, right here is definitely going to be a very important level where we are going to see if it's actually going to be respected for the first time in the entire Bitcoin history. Now this level is going to come up at approximately $15,000, just likely below our previous slide here, $14,900 area. Now another very important thing that I believe you haven't seen anywhere before on YouTube. Now, right now we are paying attention to a brand new Fibonacci channel levels where we are going to see our 0.5 Fibonacci channel very, very, very nicely respected in the past right here. Slightly lower. We do have our 0.5 where also Bitcoin got some kind of a reaction off of and also our 0.25 Fibonacci channel which hasn't really been retested ever before. <laughs> now maybe you are going to ask me bro how the heck our 0.25 Fibonacci level right here hasn't been respected if we clearly broke it towards downside and only then we got insane push towards the upside, towards a brand new Altium high. Now. The reality with this specific Fibonacci channels is we are creating them from our higher lows right here back towards a brand new Altium high. So our Fibonacci channel was formed when Bitcoin put in our Altium high right here. And of course, at this specific level, our Fibonacci channel hasn't even been formed. And because of that, our 0.25 Fibonacci channel level right here at the moment I would definitely say hasn't been hit and at the moment is going to land at approximately 12,000 users on the Bitcoin price which is definitely going to be a very important level especially if we do continue right now our way towards downside now remember a couple of days ago, I definitely shared with you a very important price target, which is actually going to be some kind of a zone from $14,000 to approximately 11,400 users. This specific main price target that you can see right here is going to be insane. Fibonacci price target where, of course, if we right now also go with our 0.25 Fibonacci channel level right here, it's going to land perfectly in our specific zone. So I would select that if Bitcoin in the upcoming days does continue its way towards downside, 
breaking through our previous lows below $15,300, we should definitely be aware of our very important price target. Let's just say at the area of 13,000 ussers. And because this level right here is an insane Fibonacci price target, most probably we can be expecting at least some kind of a reaction at this specific area. And when we hit this level, there could be potentially two different scenarios that are going to play out. Now, remember yesterday we were already talking about the Bitcoin. If we start moving towards downside with bullish RC divergence, there could be some kind of a fallen wedge pattern being formed. And what you're going to see, our diagonal level support from our fallen wedge pattern is going to come up exactly at this specific zone. Once again, our fallen wedge pattern right here is going to be valid only if there is going to be bullish divergence forming on the RC indicator. Let's say on the daily or maybe even the weekly time frame. 